Good Monday morning. Hello. It's the final Monday of the month. <gasps> That's so weird. How did we get to the end of August? I know. That like went by way too fast. It did. I feel like <laughs> it's it's almost August. Uh, it's almost September. August. Whoa. It's almost September. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like the last leg of the year always it feels like we're sprinting. And then the we're last like through summer. October, November, December flies by. Yeah. And yeah. Get ready for the sprint. Yes. And every year I, I I look at things and think, okay, I am going to clear calendar. I'm going to make sure that I am ready for this so that I can really enjoy <laughs> this time of year. And it, it ends up going by too fast. Yep. Yeah. Surprise. Yeah. yeah it it's sucks still... at the last. Yeah. Us. Hello. It's the best part of the year, and it sucks that it goes by the fastest. <laughs> yeah, I know. Sometimes I wish Thanksgiving was in January when there's not as much going on, you know, and it's still cold. And I it's wish still... it was in September. September would be good too, huh? I know. Good, good afternoon. Good morning. Maybe good evening. There's Tipsy, the mascot. Apparently, <laughs> she's so social. She's like, "It's Monday. I'm here. To say yeah. hi to my friends." Yeah, we <laughs> love you guys. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she likes to chat too. Um, so we have a uh, hello. How is everybody? Are you guys great? I'm looking forward to September. Let's do this. Yeah, this needs to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, she would kiss you back. Yeah. And lick your face. <laughs> she loves to lick and it is disgusting. <laughs> Her tongue Good is like morning. So How are you doing, Kathy? How's everybody doing? Um, <laughs> today there are quite a few homeworks to show because it is getting to the end of the month. You guys were like, ooh, yeah. gotta get this in. Yeah. Don't wanna, don't like fear, uh, fear the wrath of Mr. John. <laughs> If I turn in my homework, <laughs> it's the last minute. Mm -hmm. I, I just, I, I know that like next Monday, we're already going to have brand new homeworks. So I, I really can't, I can't like break down and go backward and show stuff from, from this month. You're it's, a good teacher, Mr. John. You're a good dean. Yes. I, 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 I dean. My rules are ridiculous and stupid, but you don't have to understand them. I need to understand them. <laughs> you know, when when we were uh, when I was learning how to be on air, when I was learning how to be a part of a morning show, um, they kept telling me, don't don't talk about and don't mention the songs that you just played. You already played them. Who cares? Nobody yeah. wants to know what you just did. Everybody <laughs> wants to know what's coming up. What are you doing? What's going on? So that's why uh, I I just can't go backwards. <laughs> it yeah. makes sense because if people yeah. tune in, they're like, oh, I missed like, that I missed, song. I didn't yeah. hear it. What are they yeah. talking about? Oh, I love I that love song. It. I wish I was here 10 minutes ago so I could hear it <laughs> yeah. on the air. I like that. Tell me about it, Liesl. Me too. Yeah. Ugh. I'm so ready for it to be cold outside and to bundle up and... I know. chunky sweaters. And... I'm so excited. <laughs> Me too. Oh. I don't know anybody who doesn't like autumn. Are there people who don't like autumn? Oh, I don't know. That should be know. illegal for real. Changing leaves, football, World Series. Uh, so mentally, I've moved on from our 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 succulents. How you doing? Um, and I'm already thinking of our next set, but. We still have some homeworks coming in yes to look at from august which is our beautiful succulents the homeworks have been so so gorgeous yeah. that's the <clears> set <throat> there's our set and the, the little set. tweaks people have been doing are just so so cute clever and i love beautiful. to look at them yeah <gasps> oh i love it all right first homework coming up is lauren ellingson Lauren said, I'm real glad I convinced my best friend, Katie Palomo, to join Magoo U or this month's homework might never have gotten done. She was <laughs> VIP this month. Sad we didn't have the third member of our crew with us, but definitely next month. 
So good. I love it. There's Carolyn Buckner. Oh, okay. We have a different. <laughs> <Bless> Sorry. <you. laughs> Look at the different background. It's that is so, so cool. I love it. I do too. Yeah. Really Thank nice. you. This is Nikki Hurt. Nikki said, I love the leaf tip, but I'm, but not the curved one. Mm. I made my gray backgrounds and my wood and bricks way too thick. My macrame was better than I expected. It was my first time using fondant molds. All in all, I learned a lot this month. Thank you, Liz. Beautiful. So good. And I like the wood. I like yeah, the I wood too. a lot. It has that same I rustic really like juxtaposition that. with the yeah. fancy. Yeah. That yeah beautiful. Yeah. So nice. And next up is Marcy Van Winkle. Oh, that's cute. Beautiful. Do you see you see how gorgeous her frame is? That is yeah. done with royal icing. Wow. Like, unless you really look at it and yeah, go yeah, like, yeah. oh, that's not one of the molds. You can tell it that's like a, a unique frame yeah. that she did. Yeah. I love that's that. That's so pretty. It's gorgeous. It turned out so, so, Looks so, so good. intricate. Also, I like the background. It's, it's so like, cool. It's, um, um, what's the word? Industrial? Is that kind of Yeah. Word? It's like almost like stacked like the other side of bricks too. Yeah. Of, it's almost like that brick look. Yeah. Really cool. Really cute. Yeah. I love it. Here's Kathy Lorenzo. Kathy said, Hi. I added a few uh, different succulents. The macrame was a challenge and had to be wiped off several times. <laughs> I do love the overall outcome though, probably because I love succulents so much. Yeah. yeah. So so cute. Those long yes. succulents. I yes. just want to touch those. I know. Oh my gosh. And the little cactus with the blossom. Yeah. Ah, it's so cute. Beautiful. So so cute. I love it. I love it. Here's Danielle Bowler Jack. Dan. Wow. So cute. Look at the um so the pretty. cement planter on the oval. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, I like the oval. I like it. Yeah. And I love how her um, macrame is tied around her pot down there. It's like, yeah. kind of like has little yeah. pom-poms on it. It's so cute. Yeah. I love it. Wow. So cute. Here's Aaron Freed. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> it gives a totally that. different yeah. feel. It's yeah. beautiful. This one's more like gaudy, you know, like very. Oh, um, that's wild. Yeah. It's so pretty. Yeah. I like her concrete, the concrete on the, mm -hmm. uh, it looks so good. <laughs> I love it. And here is Marilyn O'Neill. Marilyn said, I tried a tan version of the macrame, uh, like the one my mom had when I was a kid. Uh, oh. Loved learning all these elements. The second pick is my excellent reason for later than usual homework. Our, uh, a new adopted pack member, Stilton. Oh, 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 look at those paws. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> his coloring is so cute. Oh my gosh. That's a good reason. Yeah, that is. <laughs> and it's so pretty. Such good homework. I like the tan macro. I do too. I noticed really that right cool. away. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. It's so nice. And I, I just love that purple succulent, those purple, those dark, like almost black. Yeah. I think it's yeah. so cool. Oh. Lovely. And next is Christy Block. So cute. So good. Look at that deep gray. That's pretty. Oh, I like the the darker gray in, in the, the concrete. concrete. It almost looks like marbleized, you know? Yeah, it has a little... It's so cute. I love that. Yeah, the, and depth. her succulents are gorgeous. Ooh, oh, very pretty. Lomo. And um, Kate said, and that makes one year, eight months of homework done in a row with Karen McGinnis and Lauren, Lauren Ellingson. Even oh. if we can't always do it together, um, oh. hashtag you cross country team uh, <sighs> support each other like crazy. I really enjoy the techniques we used and, and the result. Love you all, Katie. So the feeling amazing. is mutual. Love the cookies. Love your group. Love you. You guys are amazing. The frames. The, um, and the, oh. the, um, the concrete. You see the little holes in there? I just yeah, love I love it. The extra texture. The frames. Yeah, that's beautiful. Oh, so so gorgeous. <sighs> Did you just want to do this in your backyard? Or like, I need a brick wall. Yes. Be covered in gold frames yep. and yeah, stuffed with succulents. Yeah. <laughs> this is Janice oh. Gazzo. Oh, how adorable! Dreamy. This one is so dreamy. 
so boho with the pink yeah. little yeah, soft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh, so, that's so sweet. Cute. It makes me think of like um like a, a like not a teen, but like a um a younger like boho type birthday would be so oh my sweet, gosh. Wouldn't it? Or like a baby shower. Oh my gosh, yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. Like like give make it a little more feminine and a little more so cute. Sweet. That's so cool. I Have different it. the feelings yeah. just by changing yeah. that up. This is Tessie Phillips, and Tessie said, even though this was probably the most difficult monthly class I, since I started 10 months ago, Ooh. I enjoyed it as much as ever. Good. Mm. So beautiful. Cute. I love it. Really nice. Yeah. Next up is Laura Tiernan. Gorgeous. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. So cute. How cute is that little... Every one of them, like... I... Yeah. Do you see her yeah, rough edge on that yeah. that brick uh, yeah. shape one? It's gorgeous. I love that the little frame. Yeah, yeah. And then that little little hanging guy on the macro is so I don't know why it just looks so dang adorable. It, oh, I think it's that different little cactus in there too, with a little spikies, little white spikies on it. Next is Amy Scharf, and Amy said, I struggled a lot with this one, getting the right consistency for the succulents and a variety of factors preventing me from continuing to try. Also, how do you guys pipe such fine lines? I barely have a tip off of my bag, and my lines look huge compared to the others. I, sometimes it comes down to, you have to think about consistency as well. If it's a little looser... Um, It'll bleed a little bit more. Or? Yeah, it looks like you have good consistency though. But sometimes if it's loose, it will it will always be a little bit bigger. Mm -hmm. uh, but you, you also want to find that consistency so that it's not going to lose its shape. Also, yeah, which yeah. It, the shape looks really good. Like it, it held the lines and mm -hmm. everything. But maybe a touch thicker icing, and maybe that would do it. Yeah, I wonder. It still looks so cute. I love the chunky macaroni too. Yeah, and that's not even chunky. Like yeah, I still no, think that's it's, really, it's, it's really quite thin. fine. Yeah. yeah. Next is Ileana Levinsky. Oh, so <gasps> oh my! Look at the look at the purple ones up in the the yeah. corner. Oh my gosh! And the little additional oh, blossoms are just that one is so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh! The yellow and pink little Agatha <sighs> blossoms, huh? The added little different types of succulents. Just, yeah. I like looking for them. It's like hide and seek. <laughs> I love the different vibe that the little tweaks give. And look at the um, the uh, texture on her concrete. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't that fun? So fun. It reminds so me good. of the, you know what it reminds me? It reminds me of the Disneyland uh, parking garage. How <laughs> it has the circles. The like, the like. Oh, it's so hard to if you if you found if I'll show you a picture afterwards because it looks exactly like the concrete stamped concrete. Huh. Yes, huh. yes. Oh. And this is Linda Taylor, and Linda Taylor said, uh, "Needing more practice with my macrame, and some of my succulents may be hybrids." This uh, lesson left me dreaming of succulents. I made my own fondant for the first time, rather than purchasing it. Thank there you for watching us. That so is cool. cool. Is it the marshmallow fondant? I wonder. Um, I've used that before. I, I'm glad to see it works so well too. It took yeah. the molds really well, and it made yeah. the, that like light, light, nice little curve mm -hmm. in the pot. It was so cute. Very pretty. Look at the little face in there. <laughs> like a little succulent fairy hiding down there. <laughs> That's and so just cool. so you know, um, with Marcy's here, she did make a comment. She said, "I'm not a fan of fondant, so the frame and pot are both royalizing." Wow. Oh, didn't even notice yeah. The pot was, me neither. Yeah, that I think that looks so absolutely. Good gorgeous so it's funny because i don't even think i'd notice that the frame was real i think except i would like to look for those differences yeah, in yeah. Each, everybody's set to see what makes it mm -hmm. like feel different yeah it's really great i don't i don't know why we have a spinning oh. wheel right now um, hopefully we're still okay you're still you're still going okay, okay. good okay. yeah all all is good yeah. it's just uh yeah every once in a while you get a little spinning wheel, spinning <laughs> wheel. got to turn around um that's a song um as one of, you're a you're a deadline motivated person you've been switching things up in your house to create the space you need and i'll have my homework turned in again <laughs> that's exciting um you're setting up your cookie space it sounds like uh you supposed to the university syllabus i love oh. that 
Yeah. Perhaps so. Perhaps I need to. Okay. <laughs> what is expected of me? <laughs> we can. Yeah. Yeah. It's another. Yeah. It's still so hot. Yeah. Especially Halloween. Halloween. You don't think so? Now, I know, Chris, that, that that it can sometimes be daunting, and there are a few people I think that are going to opt for for saving this one for. Uh, what November, December, or January when they have time. But remember, if you miss a if you miss a month, that's okay. If you miss a couple of months, it's all right. You have the ability to do up to six months of makeup work in in January and February of next year. So yeah. you'll be able to 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 do this set or finish it and then and then post the pictures. It'll be great. Yeah. yeah. Don't beat yourself up. Right. And life happens. <laughs> yeah. Sure. And that's why that makeup month is so fun. It's such a great way to be like, oh, okay, mm -hmm. I, yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't have to be all for like, it was all a waste. I missed my, yeah. you know, if you yeah. did a year of it and you come up on your 12th month and you're like, that, it's oh. all gone. Mm, that would suck. Yeah, so yeah. it's nice to not have yeah. that, that heart as hard of pressure. Yeah. So yeah. great. Oh, <laughs> so I love it. Like the cheese um, and cake. Um, I, um, 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 a cake and a cookie space. Yeah, oh, that's, that's cool. cool. Yeah, it makes such a difference uh, to have all your stuff where you can get at it easily yeah. and where, oh my gosh, it's made such a big difference. Which reminds me, I finally listened to the podcast. Um, oh my gosh. There's a podcast called, I always have to think about it, like Baking a Living. Mm -hmm. And it's by George Ann Bell and Amy Pope. And uh, it's it's a new, I think it was uh, introduced in June. So it's a, still a new podcast. And I was recently a guest on there. So um, I finally brought up got enough courage to listen to it on i believe it was wednesday i was like do i really talk that fast oh my gosh what no what? it was but so good it was so good it was so fun to talk to them and you got to go listen to all the episodes it's such a great yeah. thing to do while you're decorating mm -hmm. because you're not splitting your time between something you're watching and binging on netflix it's something just mm -hmm. audio you just keep on working through and in uh yeah. I love listening to podcasts as I as I decorate. So you gotta yeah. go check it out. It's such a great podcast. Yeah, uh, you can find it on Spotify or wherever you listen to music or uh, podcasts. Mm -hmm. Apple Apple Podcasts or Spotify. Yeah, I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, <laughs> um, we did talk. Oh, um, Kathy didn't see her homework. Um. Yeah, he we need to make sure everybody's that does turn it in gets done there because hmm. I don't know if we're done showing the whole are we? I don't that's what I was wondering. I'm like, is he I think we are, but maybe not. I don't know. Mr. John's a mystery. In the meantime, um <laughs> we did say we'd do a what? Hey. Yes. I know yes. there's some exciting yeah. Yeah, announcements here too yeah. we got we got a couple yeah. things we have new new homework mm -hmm. information we have yes. a giveaway that we promised yes. we have a, a taste testing that we promised too oh we did <gasps> yeah oh shoot that's right so i we have a couple options but i did make a a cookie um from our good friends uh chris and paul we could taste that <gasps> oh my gosh yeah i had another thing in my butt this this we have the cookie. It's in the it's in the kitchen of the Let me go bowl. Grab. Were you done showing homeworks? Yes, I was. Oh, because we didn't get. Did we not see? Uh, did we miss Kathy's last week, or have we seen Kathy? Um, no, I had it. I had it. I gave you credit. I know you have you have it in. Did we uh -oh. show it though? Yeah, it was the last one that we showed. I didn't see that one. <gasps> there you go. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, what the texture. That? I love that. What texture mat is that? Yeah, what the? Isn't that fun? It's, it's like so it's like cute. hammered. Yeah. Um. Um. 
It's like those that's mugs so cool. and stuff yeah, that oh, are yeah, yeah. hammered, you know? Yeah, that's what it looks like. And then so the little cute. butterfly. I love it. Yeah. Look at the little aged brick. I am digging yeah. that. Yeah. Yay. Hello. I'm so glad we didn't miss it. Okay. Yeah. He, he, you didn't show that one. You oh. did it. <laughs> that is the cutest. Oh my that gosh. That is funny. <laughs> you haven't made yeah, we're good. we're about to show you. You're yeah. just in time. We're doing Can a taste it? test and then a giveaway. You listen to it, Linda. I'm so glad. That's so fun. And then introducing next month. I still am like, oh my gosh, why didn't I say this? I should have said this. What you know. I guess that's why we just keep chatting. We get to learn more about each other uh, throughout our, you know, those chats. Right? Um, you listened yesterday, which brings me to Mr. John. Ah. You have to do Gomez Adam. Mr. John hasn't listened to the podcast. Ah. <laughs> Even if just on a Monday minute. I agree. Hmm. You talked about, about Halloween costumes, huh? No, I didn't. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we did. Uh, you want to grab the book too? Sorry, you're like oh. yes. Um, so we're gonna do a little a little taste test. I um I finished filming uh, my some of the things that I need to get done, and to celebrate, I was like so excited that I finished that I was like I am gonna give myself a treat, and I'm going to make a cookie recipe that I've been wanting to make ever since I got this book. Mm. This is. The uh, fabulous modern cookies. Is this backwards for you? That's the only problem. Uh oh, we didn't mirror it. Uh, this is Chris Taylor and Paul, our good buddies that made the pie recipe beautiful. This is our newest edition. Um, and look, if you haven't seen, look who has a little quote on the back, a little blurb. This lady. Oh my gosh. <laughs> But it's not about me. It's about it's about these two amazing gentlemen and the amazing recipes that they have. They have so many. I know. It's insane. It's insane. This thing is a revelation. This so is small backwards. So good. Oh, good. It's not <laughs> again. So as soon as I got this, I saw I saw this recipe, Tiger Tail. Which you guys know what Tiger Tail is? You need to discover it. It's we Canadian to, flavor. Yeah, we went to Canada. How long? Like. A while ago and they had this ice cream called tiger tail and it's orange and black licorice it sounds and it, so weird oh my god it sounded so weird that i had to try it and then uh, we all got addicted yeah yeah <laughs> every time we'd go to an ice cream place, i have like, dreams about tiger it. tail ice cream please i have dreams about it for real and i see sylvia you are a you are a fan she's our Canadian friend, she knows what's up yes. for sure. Yes. Um, so I got to, we got to make it. I totally did the marbling wrong as I was reading the instructions. Like, oh, I didn't do that right, but it came out really pretty. Yeah, it still is so gorgeous. And I, I tried to track down star anise, those little cool guy mm -hmm. spices, and we, I could not find them anywhere. So I ended up getting having to wait uh, to get it from Amazon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sure there's somewhere, but I just uh, it may. I feel like our kitchen still You're smells like You're not a black licorice anise. fan at all. Really? Oh, man. I love black licorice. See, Chris and Paul are not either, but they love tiger tail ice cream and the tiger tail flavor. So you still have to try it, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we're going to try it. Even though we've already tried it, I will try these until they're gone. I'll try them. I'm, yeah. like, I'm not sure again. I need to try it again. So it has orange zest mm. in it and then the star anise all ground up in there in the black uh, dough. The wonderful things about these two. Okay, so I meant this on Wednesday as I talk with my mouth full. Mm. Mm. They don't get the they don't get hard. I feel like they get better. Yeah. Which is not something I ever say about cookies. It's almost like the You do, Don. Yeah. And if you can track down tiger tail ice cream, mm -hmm. black licorice on its own. No. Oh, interesting. Isn't that funny? Mm -hmm. Something about that orange. Yeah. Makes it flavor with the black licorice. No, <laughs> <laughs> something is magical, mm. and I just don't understand why it hasn't crossed the border. Why can't I get that in my grocery store? <laughs> Should make chocolate and vanilla dough to make that instead of licorice. Oh, totally. Yeah, or an orange and uh, vanilla, orange and chocolate. I mean, but, that's a huge thing. But you know, guys, we've been there. We've been there. We've we've done chocolate and vanilla. 
That's we true. Went there. Go somewhere else. Go go to Orange and and Licorice and give it a whirl. Give it a whirl. When yeah. we were in when we were in Canada, we went to that ice cream place. I I saw that and it sounded so weird that I had to get it, and my yeah. life changed forever that day. So so go somewhere else. Don't go, don't go to Chocolate Vanilla Land. You've been there. You've been there. You've been there. Was it somewhere new? <laughs> well, where was it that you guys were talking about? London, where it was orange and yeah, orange and chocolate big i mean that's it's a common pairing for me in, that's christmas in england because of the little orange very the, yeah the orange um chocolate oranges yeah chocolate oranges that we get those every single year in our stockings and dude it's like the best it's it's one of my favorite mm -hmm. presents this yeah. tastes better than it did i know i feel like it just like ages yeah it know? doesn't get stale yeah Oh my gosh, I know. I love that. We you met Sylvia when mm. we were in Montreal. I think you might have met her at CookieCon too. Mm. So I can't believe how long ago that was. I mean, yeah. Or how not long ago that was, but how much has changed. <laughs> All the things. Yeah. So fun. Uh, I love the sense, but not the taste. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Give mm. give this a whirl. Get it? Whirl. <laughs> Not many cookies like are get better over time. I can't think of a cookie that does. Yeah, chocolate chip the cookies. The chocolate chipotle. That one gets hotter over time. Yeah, it gets yeah, easier. Yeah, it yeah, Terry's chocolate orange. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yep. The dark that's chocolate ones. Yeah. The kids invited me back to the hotel to go to the pool. That's what they. Yeah, I think that's what they most remember about their trip. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Swimming in the hotel pool. <laughs> that was a highlight. Um, it is time for. A giveaway okay for the giveaway yeah i was not gonna say that so we have some exciting news exciting news uh we got some more cutters in the shop um they're back they're back they are restocked um and they are they're no joke um we have the flower pot it's uh, either a tree it's made of the broccoli mm -hmm. it's a shape we had long ago mm-hmm did Ann Clark ever make that one? No. We just, we sold out of it mm -hmm. and we, we didn't carry it, but we got so many requests like, okay, where did this guy go? Yeah. You know, where did this cutter go? Uh, so we decided to bring it back. It's a lovely cutter. It's a great shape. It's, it's so a, cute. It could be a bouquet of flowers. It could be it could a be flower. Jar, jar. The, yeah. Yeah. But broccoli. It's, it's so, good so cute. Um, and then we have these amazing. The cake, cake stands are back. Cake stands. They're so flipping cute. I am obsessed with these ones like imagine just a little pastry in that one and a little cupcake in this one i have Ugh. so many designs in those i can't even tell I you know. how much i use those yeah uh that one we sold out of years ago mm -hmm. and then um ann clark ended up carrying it for a while um and then it's back it's back in our shop yep um it's slightly different than the one ann clark did it's just a little more sleek i get a sleek that's not the right word um it's not as as bulbous, I guess, here and mm, here. Mm. So this is back to the OG design um, that was altered just a bit. Oh, I love it. the Ann Clark one too. It's it's cool. But yeah, um, this is and more. Then we have one more, <laughs> and that is the piping bag clown cookie cutter. Yeah, um, that was sold out. So cute, and um, it's back. Uh, and that's it's in a lot of Maguyus as well, especially Halloween and. Um, yeah. yeah, but for the giveaway, for the giveaway, hold on. For the giveaway, we can do a hashtag, and then we can do a random a, a random generator. Perfect. Yes, I love it. Oh. Um, the there, I think there's our pictures of them on the website. Um, but I have a billion of them, and I feel like I don't know if I posted all of them, but I mm -hmm. will. Maybe on on Instagram too. I'll put it in my. I'll make a reel of it because there are like so many different ways that I've decorated them that I'll just yeah. post them all on there and make it good rocket chip. Um, <clears throat> that's, yeah, that's adorable. Um, yeah. George, George did, did a firecracker of that. It's so cute. Oh, I love yes, that one. Yes. The, the bow and arrow too. Bow and arrow. Georgianne is like master of re, yeah. re imagining that the, the bow and arrow for Valentine's is so cute on that one. So cute. Um, okay. So what is the, what's the hashtag? What do you want to do? I can Let's do it. Let's do 
It could be anything. So what's going to, so t first tell us. Do three of them, right? Like one for each one. Oh, okay. We can do that. So yeah. we'll, we'll tell you the hashtag. You'll type it in and we'll yep. give you a little bit. And then you'll randomly pick from those people who typed in the hashtag. Is that right? Yeah. So and I'll show, you, I'll show you it. What's that? I'll show you when we, when we draw. So you'll okay. have about, about Perfect. 15 seconds to type in after we give you the hashtag. Oh, so it is a speed thing. Okay. So we were just making it that. So there you go. Okay. But it's not like the first one who types it in wins. No. It's like if you type in the hashtag, then you'll be entered to win. Yeah. As simple as that. That's right. That's right. It. You gotta know, gotta know what's expected here because this is <laughs> this is high stakes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So it. for the first hashtag, because we're gonna do three giveaways. Yes. And also, by the way, one for each of the cars, the cake stands are together in a set. And you can't win twice. So if you win twice, we redraw. I love it. That sounds fair. Okay. The first one we are going to do is going to be this one. Okay. The piping bag clown. Um, What should the hashtag be? The hashtag should be piping bag, which hashtag, hashtag means the number... Uh, symbol. Amper, wait, no, that's not an ampersand. Yeah, it's not an ampersand. It's a, a number symbol with piping, piping bag, bag with no spaces. Do, do, do. Piping bag. Just piping like bag. Laura just showed. Yes. Great example. <laughs> there right. it is, piping bag. It doesn't even have to be uppercase, so don't worry about that. Mm. Nope, that's right. As long as it's hashtag piping a bag. Yes. I'm looking at all your windows. I'm stocking. You have them all, Bernadette. She collected the whole set. But yeah. you can trade with friends. See, you can gift it. Mm. Gotta catch them all. <laughs> They're like... All right. All right. Are we ready to draw? You have five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Draw. Wow. That's like a shooting gallery. Yes. Draw. Oh boy. Oh. Yeah. oh. <laughs> she just won the Freebie Friday not that long ago, too. You are what a, a lucky winner, duck. winner, chicken dinner. Amazing. You get this piping bag cookie cutter. Um, and that could be so many, so many things, too. Oh, I've yeah. used that thing for rocket, countless. clown, the cat, a gnome would be cute. The cat or moon face. Uh, yes, Halloween yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yay! Yay, Lisa! Okay. okay. The next one will be the flower pot. The flower pot. The Is flower. that what you call it? I would think so. I see it as a tree more than that. But then again, no, it's flat. I think that's broccoli. <laughs> I also made this into a Dia de los Muertos. Oh, face. yeah, that's right. I trimmed the bottom just a bit and yeah. did roses all around that's the head right. there on those I little I remember bolts. that one. Yep. All right, so what is the hashtag for uh, for the flower pot? The hashtag for this one will be drum roll, please. Broccoli, broccoli. <laughs> like everybody, it, it, there's going to be four different spellings of broccoli. Broccoli, so, that's <laughs> true. That yeah. is true. Well, we're going to do mason jar flower. <laughs> no, we're gonna do flower flower f-l-o-w-e-r hashtag, flower. <laughs> hashtag flower oh hashtag my god flower. here we go <laughs> flower which flower whole wheat no. oh my gosh unbleached <laughs> right there hashtag flower hashtag Rye flower, flower. Yeah. 15 in <laughs> Hashtag flower. There you go. Margo's on it. Flower. Also, with these winnings, you have to post a picture of you using these guys. I feel like that would be so cool. Picture with you with you in the cook cutter or using it. Yeah, like using like a set that they do or like I mean that yeah, that'd be very cool. go. Nikki All is right. not missing this one. Exactly. <laughs> oh, Covering your bases. <laughs> Gluten-free oh, flour, right? Almond flour. <laughs> All right. Tapioca flour. We're gonna draw in five, four, three, two, 
one, draw. Pew. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. It's slowing down. <laughs> Yay! Very nice, very nice. Let me tell you, she is a winner. I know, I know. So far, two winners. They are winners. Yes. yes. Liesl and Becky. Let me tell you. Yeah. They are winners. You're all winners. You're all winners. It's just you're not all winners. <laughs> <laughs> all right. The this, last one. The cake. The, I feel like this is going to be the yeah. most anticipated one. I love these. I mean, two cutters. Two cutters in one. Two oh prizes. Bonus prize. Yeah. I love these ones. They're so I cute. Too. They're so cute. Yeah. The hashtag. <laughs> Something simple. Is going to be. <laughs> the suspense is killing me. <laughs> yeah. You do it. You do it. I cake I stand. Cake stand. Cake stand. Hashtag cake stand. Yes. Just like that. Beautiful. All right. Not a handstand. Not a headstand. I want that too. You do. I want you do. It. It's I... the best. <laughs> I'm They're biased, so but cute. it's really. They're it's... so cute. Oh. And if you don't also, win. These are very reasonably priced if you've got to yes. have a cake stand. And who doesn't? It's $6 uh, for two $6 cutters. For two cutters. What are we doing? I was like, are you? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and these would be so cute. Like if it was Christmas time and you would do a cake, but like decorate it inside it like Christmas. Like, yeah. That would be so cute. Oh, I've done a little, um, like a little winter scene with a little gingerbread house oh, and yeah, a little that's snow right. and a little deer in there. <gasps> So cute. Or Halloween. Oh, yeah. uh, Halloween. So I've done a pumpkin under the clothes, Halloween. like a little pumpkin. Yeah. Yeah. There's so many ways you can decorate oh, these. I so cute. I know. All right, yo. We're Thanks, gonna draw in okay. five. Is everybody in? Four. Three. Two. One. Draw. <laughs> if someone wins twice, I'm gonna be like, okay. <laughs> You're just too ah, done, Nelson. Done. Another winner. Yay. There are no losers in this group. I, I would yeah. think anytime, man. Any of you guys would be amazing. You guys are all amazing. Yes. Oh. Uh, so those three are just extra amazing today. <laughs> <laughs> extra lucky today. We have yeah. yay. We have one more announcement. We do? The next month. Oh, the Please. homework. The next month's cookies. The deer at your first cookie con. That was magical. <laughs> that was fun. Because <laughs> you get to be excited for someone yeah. else too, which is fun still, yeah. even if you don't win. Yeah. <laughs> and you get to see your name scrolling through. And I you're know. Like, Maybe. That's kind of fun. No. That's okay. kind of fun. Yeah. We should do those more often. It's cute. Yeah. Congrats. And also, <laughs> it's, it's beneficial to you guys because you guys get up and you guys watch our... Monday mornings. Keith Urban last night. Oh, I love Keith Urban. I bet that was so fun. Oh, He's you know what Mr. John and I did last night? Hmm. We um we watched the suspense again. Um, we watched Mrs. Harris. Miss Harris. Mrs. Harris goes to Paris. What? I need to watch a great it. movie. It's so cute. If you want to just have a feel good, like, oh my gosh, it's so sweet. Is that the cutest thing ever? Um, <clears throat> and so that covering us too. It's time to look at the homework for next he week. He is so pretty. <laughs> yeah, he's he's pretty. He's pretty. He's pretty. He's pretty. He's pretty. <laughs> you just read it. I bet oh, it's such it's a, a sweet book. book. Oh. oh my gosh. I know it's a remake, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I believe it was Angela Lansbury. Right. Mm. Uh, so the remake was just so sweet. I loved it. Loved it. Ready for next month's cookies, mother? First, show the shapes, okay? All right. Uh, we are familiar. loving. I know <laughs> we are really loving these uh, cookies. I've right? Always kind of been stuck on a rectangle. I I love how many things you can yeah. do with it. Uh, this particular rectangle is three and a half by four inches. It's the same one as the same. Last one, right? 
as last month. Mm -hmm. I think so. And she goes, New York also. Really? Are you kidding me? Yay, rectangles. Yay. <laughs> it's pretty easy shape to uh, hand cut if you need to chew. Yep. Yeah. And also transfer onto a, yeah. a It's a nice sheet. dirty shape. Yes, yes. The other thing might look familiar as well. A shirt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're excited about rectangles. <laughs> <laughs> um, it smells so good. You just gave them a sneak peek. I mean, which one? Which anyway. one should we show first? Again, I still haven't invested in a shirt cutter, so this is my onesie cutter with just the little <laughs> snappy booty cut off. Uh, just a little. <laughs> I've been using my onesie cutter more often I too. Know, yeah. <laughs> Big geometry fans out there. Yes. <laughs> Next is a quadrilateral and a, <laughs> a rhombus. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so the big reveal, we'll, we'll reveal them one at a time. All right. I feel like, I feel like this one. Oh, yeah. that one. Yeah. That one. That one. That the one. shirt first. Yes, okay. Yes. And maybe. Okay. This is the least telling. I mean, I yeah. guess. Okay. So that's the, that's the first one. What do you, what do you think the theme is here? Yeah, we'll, we'll give you guys a chance to guess. I, I think it's so the other cute. two are very, very telling. <laughs> very, very telling. Literally spells it out. Yeah, I mean, this <laughs> one's pretty. It, it should be pretty. There we go, Amy. Boom. Yes. Should we show Becky. This yes. This one first. This one next. Or that one next. 50s is a good guess because it is definitely a, a retro feel. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Maybe yours. Little... So cute. Neon sign. <laughs> pink ladies. Oh, that is good too, right? That's it cute. Gives yeah. Pink lady vibes. Totally. It totally does. Yeah. I was thinking that too. So um, cute. The little retro sign. And then ba -da -da -da, the action shot. The pins a flying. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, a little little action shot. Uh, so you cute. can do it in whatever colors you like. I decided to go with the retro. Yeah color scheme of course you could do very neon or or yeah you could do one color really um, yeah but that's the so cute see here i did it in red, red. yeah and i didn't feel like it quite tied in as well yeah because i kept imagining that's the only thing red. That's red yeah you know in the set but it is fun to see it in a different color um because i know you guys do that for homework and yeah. you always uh give it a new feel and stuff yeah, green um, would be cute. Yellow, but I feel know. like doing it in blue ended up tying it together just a yeah. little bit better. Yeah. So yeah, it's a it's a fun set. Uh, it's you know, it's just a feel good. Like bowling makes you feel good. Yeah. <laughs> makes Even you if feel you younger. suck at it, you know. Right up like, your it's... alley. Oh, look at I you! I love it. Boom! Yeah. I didn't yeah. think I used that pun in my intro. I love it. Missed opportunity. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And you, you definitely don't have to be ridiculous and embroider your name on there. Like that was just, that's an extra little, <laughs> but the bowl, you yeah. know, there are definite little, little hacks to that for sure. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, it it's will do great. One. Making the coconut cream pie shirt. Ooh. Oh, really? That sounds. That sounds so amazing. I'm obsessed with cream pies, any type of cream pie. Coconut cream, Coconut. banana cream, chocolate, chocolate. cream, anything. Mm -hmm. Pistachio. Strike. I love it. They're so, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, the other thing is the bowling ball is, shiny, it can be shiny. a marbled one. I just felt like in this specific uh, layout, it was much stronger to just do a solid, mm -hmm. um, a color. solid color for the bowling ball. Mm hmm I did one with marble that I'm like, it just wasn't, you know, I wanted the action to be yeah, more of the focus, the... but I can see you guys doing all kinds of creative amazing, things. With amazing it. ideas. Yeah. I feel like this set really lends itself to a lot of variation on, on color scheme, on the ball, on, on yes. a mixment of things. Is that for those that are new? Um, would you, would you go into a little, a little detail on that? Is that, is that preferred? Would you rather not have variation? Would you want the set made perfectly? What, what, what is, what do you expect from home? I expect perfection always. I'm just kidding. No, <laughs> um, I, love... me. I know that's not true. <laughs> you, you're, you're what started it. My expectations on perfection. <laughs> um, I feel like it's really the techniques that that are the key. You know, that's that's what we want to do. I 
I want you to look at it and go, ooh, that, like Sylvie said, ooh, that makes me scared, you know. Uh, doing those are what matters. Pushing yourself to do those little uncomfortable things is how you get stronger creative muscles. So that's really the focus is mm -hmm. do the techniques, do the, the the style, the design. But as far as colors go, as far as, oh, I didn't have fondant or I don't like, you know, this color. Mm -hmm. Switching all that stuff up um, as long as you're you're doing, showing your work, <laughs> showing your your techniques on the cookies is what, what really counts. Yeah. You can, it doesn't even have to say bowl. You can, Mary Jean, boom, you guys. <laughs> you know how I love puns. You guys are hitting me right in the, right in the feels. Oh, my. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. the And, like, if the, the font is different, you mm -hmm. know, if you're more comfortable, ooh, it, you know, it's much easier for me to do a cursive letter or, you know, I messed up on this font. So they're all different fonts. Oh, my gosh, that'd be so cute. That would be really cute. So, yeah, it's really about uh, just kind of getting getting a little uncomfortable a little stronger in some of the things and then yeah uh, yeah. yeah i love seeing the variations though. yeah i think it's so i nice. love seeing the different colors the different you know shirt details or yeah. Yeah. working with what you have yeah too yeah because sometimes you're like i don't want to buy a whole new you know you go on different cutters and different different shapes and different uh yeah things like that i love that <sighs> yeah <clears throat> So, new cutters giveaway. We did the taste test. Mm -hmm. We talked about the podcast. Yeah, we did it all. We did it all. We did it all. <laughs> you guys are so dang fantastic. I yeah. think we have all your addresses that uh, you guys won, right? I think we're good with that. I um, can you hear the song that I'm playing? Oh man, okay. Because I'm I'm playing a song, but I you think it's not going, yeah, I think it's not going through the the system. But yeah, I, I as it started playing, I'm like, oh, this is too deep. They're not gonna under they're not gonna know score tonight, which is played in the bowling alley scene in Grease Two. Oh wow, <laughs> Grease Two. Oh, no, that is a train wreck. That is <laughs> it embarrasses me. That movie wreck. makes me feel embarrassed. Oh man, wow. Um, yeah. Something I did want to mention, do you know of a homemade fondant recipe that's good? I would love to try and make my own. I've used the marshmallow fondant recipe that's I just found online, but I've only done that once. So I am definitely not a pro with that. Does anybody have a good fondant recipe? Freebie Friday? We did a freebie Friday. Um, we can... Have you pulled a winner? I have not pulled a winner. So you'll do that today. I will do that today and announce it in nice. the group. Um, Very good. Yes. Um. If you go <clears throat> into your settings on your Maguyu account, um, you love it. I know some people love it. I think it's, it's like you need to watch sometimes. it at the right timing, at the right age. Yeah. Kind of like Hocus Pocus. I think I saw it too late where I was like, this is so cringy. I can't yeah. handle it. It's like Hocus Pocus. You don't like Hocus Pocus, but it's I like, like Hocus Pocus. It's part of my childhood. I like it, but I don't have that same, like like absolute love for it. Uh, but if you go in your Maguyu account, make sure that your address is updated. Um, I know sometimes when people sign up for things, they're like, this doesn't matter. And they don't really put in their address or, or it's partial or whatever. If you keep that updated, that helps us send the patches to the right place, send any uh, giveaways or anything to the right spot. So, um, cause sometimes we get patches sent back like, oh, this isn't the right address. So if you're earning patches or if you want to earn patches or you mm -hmm. want to, um, you know, like it to be a real simple way to send mm -hmm. you, you know, uh, stuff uh, your yeah. winnings or your patches yeah. um just make sure your address in there is updated so that's why i love your group i don't buy something all the time yeah good i i don't like to buy things yeah. all the time i'm a i'm a frugal person <laughs> and uh i i like to help others be frugal too whether yeah. they want to or not no. yeah. <laughs> some people are like tell me to buy more things you want to buy all the things yeah yeah there we go <laughs> yeah <laughs> and it is fun to buy new things totally but um it's it's great to to get creative with what you have too. <laughs> Good. I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> Most too. Yeah. That's a, they follow that formula and it's like, they should have stopped at the first movie. Yeah. <laughs> it, it was a good idea. Um, <clears throat> but there are, a, there are a couple of twos that are better than the original. Yes. You think Godfather two. Godfather two. Godfather two <laughs> is a, a, a hair above number one. But also, but T two, T two, 
Terminator 2? I, I don't know Sad. Terminator 2. Okay. Uh, I don't know the Terminators. But the Harry Potter sequels were great. You bring those straight to Lebowski. Not <laughs> with the bowling. <laughs> yes. Not, yes. Oh my it's gosh. still not as good as Harry Potter number one, though. I, I got Lebowski. you, Chris. I knew exactly what you're... Yeah. Oh. I so love you. You have homework, okay? You hate it. <gasps> cheese Factor. Nobody used to do it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't. See, I, I enjoy the cheese focus. factor of Hocus Pocus and I hate Grease too. We're yeah. like, <laughs> special. Thank you. All right, enabled you once this morning. Amazon, she's good at that. She's real good at that. Uh, by marriage. That's <laughs> hilarious. Mr. John is frugal by marriage. <laughs> good. Oh, I love that. Uh, so if you're going to go buy something, go buy Hocus Pocus. You need to watch that. Godfather Go by two. Godfather 2, <laughs> Fabulous Modern Cookies, um, <laughs> Cake Stand Cutters. No. Yes. <laughs> All the cutters, you know. Everything from the shop. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> you, only, you only do have, what? where are we here? Only a couple of days left mm -hmm. to yeah. get the Cookie Enabler Kit um, at 50% off. If you don't know what the cookie enabler kit is, this is like the, 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 a beginner kit for tips. So you get a coupler in there, you get what, six tips, Yep. a little case. And I think 10 of the, of the disposable bags. So yep. it's mm -hmm. an absolutely great kit for, uh, to, to, to buy for someone or, um, just to have a, a whole bunch of tips at a hugely discounted price. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. It's an amazing deal. And it's also your last few days to turn in homework. Um, so that's the, yep, the kit. That's and, all the its glory. kit. Um, and it comes in a cute little box too <laughs> for cookie emergencies. Um, uh, but it's your last few days to also turn in homework. Uh, we probably won't show it on Magoo Minute, but you will have, you know. The homework turned in and on you the page credit you still. get credit you get credit so um and we also have live classes coming up we have one september 17th and that is an intermediate class so that should be fun uh we have one on the 8th of october and that is advanced and we're so excited for that one um and there's also one on the 19th of november and that's a beginner and the third of uh, Christmas, the third, third of Christmas, Christmas. Um, the third of December, and that is also beginner. So it's, but <laughs> even if you're an advanced or an intermediate cookie decorator, you could probably come to any of these and have fun and learn some, some new stuff and hang out with really cool people. The beginner as well. classes. Yeah. That would be uh, just a relaxing hangout yeah. and yeah. play date, but and uh, very fun stuff yeah fun stuff happening holidays are coming up august or autumn is coming up and uh this is the real cookie season yes uh hopefully you guys are doing amazing yeah you guys are awesome yes i always look forward to chatting with you mm -hmm. um you don't know how much today i needed to chat with my friends yeah. <laughs> So we'll talk to you next Monday. We'll be here. Yes. It'll be a new month. Yes. We might have some homework to turn in. And uh, already. Yeah. Thank you for being a friend. Yeah. To quote the Golden Girls. <laughs> uh, and, and we'll chat with you next Monday. Yes. In the meantime, have, have